Hello. Hello, hello. Welcome, everybody. It's me, Junk Journal and Jen. I am so sorry that I'm late. I actually was asleep. <laughs> and I just woke up. So if you don't mind, just give me a quick minute. Give me a quick minute. Let me just get a little spot of tea. I'll be right back. Will you hold down chat for me? I'll be right back, okay?
Okay. Coming in hot. Okay, friends, hello, hello. Let me get my gear set up. Thank you for being so patient. I am so sorry for falling asleep on the show. What was I thinking? <clears throat> I have to be honest with you, so tired today. I had the appointment with my oncologist and, um, yeah, I'm here. I made it. I made it to the junk journaling Dollar Tree prayer journal challenge. I guess that's what we're calling it. <laughs> hello, hello. Let's see who is here. Um, let's see. So first we have 12 people in chat. Let's move us live. Bam. Bam, shake a lamb, lamb. Here we go. Oh, hello. Hello, Toby and Etta and Brenda. Let's see. And Penny. Mama Shenanigans. Hello. I see. Do, 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 do. Who else? Renee. Hello. Renee. Hello, Kimberly. Hello, hello. Hello, Stacy, And hello, everybody. So glad that you're here. Hopefully, we'll have a couple of our other friends pop in. There you are, Bridget. I was just thinking about you. I was like, we're going to have a couple more friends pop in. Amen. Amen. So, I got my... um. prayer cards out. I got the prayer journal out and I've been mapping out what I'm going to do. I don't know what you guys I'm trying to wake myself up with a little essential oil here. A little camphor and a little lavender. Um, oh, this book, isn't it gorgeous? Hello. Hello, Dawn. Oh my, my you guys might camera is a little crooked. Let me fix it. How's that? Is that better? Are we better? Are we crooked guys? Let me know. I can't tell. Hello Dawn. Okay, let me put my hot coffee on here. Yeah, relaxed and sleepy. I know. But it's really, really, I don't know, strong. But I don't need to get too, uh, like, hyped up, huh? Okay, so let's do this. Um, so I want to show you what I got. Um, I don't know. I don't, I don't know if this one, I got to check the date on it. But look at these old hymns. Aren't those fun? So I got those, I got these. And so I thought what I would do is I'll, um, you know, cause I don't want to just sew one book. I mean, I'd love to do that, but then we wouldn't be sharing. So I'm going to break these up into like sets of say 10 or maybe even eight. I'm not sure yet, but sets of 10 I'm thinking so that everybody could get some. Aren't those pretty? Look at that. And I think this one's all copyright free, so I'm going to actually keep this one. Nope, I'm selling this one. Yep. 
I'm selling the pages out of this one. This one and a couple of these. So I'm going to let you guys know when I'm going to do that. It, but it's coming up. Like I'm going to do it in the next couple of days. And then you guys can just hold boxes here if you want. Because I'll be releasing some new stuff in the next, you know. See, this one's 1910. So I'll be using all of this for digitals. Some of it. Some of it. Pretty cool, huh? Do they smell amazing? Ooh, yeah, that one does. Let me check this one. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that smells good. This one smells the best. That one's, I think, the oldest. Okay, so let's get to our Dollar Tree Challenge. That's a button. Okay, so this is what... I've been marinating a lot on this. I don't know if you guys read the description um, down below. About what we're doing here. Uh-oh. I just lost my little tag. Oop, I got gotcha. <clears throat> okay, so here we go. Let's get started. Maybe we could get a, what, an essential oil called Book Sniffer. Yeah, or, or get it called, called Old Book, right? Okay, so this is the journal that I picked, but it's, it doesn't mean anything. The cover doesn't mean anything, right? So what I thought you would do is pick a journal from Dollar Tree because it already has paper in it, right? Even though it doesn't matter, but it's, you know, whatever. And then pick a stack of prayer cards. It doesn't matter which ones. It can match your journal or not. Okay. So. I say that you still have to use the cover. But you don't have to use what it says. You can cover the cover up. Okay. But you have to use the, the, the um, existing cover. You can cut the cover. You can cut it. You can cut it. Right. Um, you can cut the pages. And then I was going to say, you know how there's the staples in the center? I was going to say, um, how about we can only take, say, 10 pages out? Right? So are you guys getting this all? Because I don't want to have to write this all out. It's just too much. You can watch the video. So take 10 pages out. So get your little staple lifter upper. You haven't been able to find the prayer cards? Don, I can I could uh mail you a stack. Let me show you what colors I have. Okay, hold on. I'm only keeping two stacks for myself, and then I know that Etta um has been generous already to Miss Brenda, so that works. <clears throat> It looks like, I don't know if the cards are the same or not. Okay. These are the two I have left. And I can pick up more, too. So there's these ones. They're all that color. This color on the back. You can't get to the Dollar Tree? I understand. And we're noticing that's that's what's going on with a lot of people because a lot of us are handicapped, right? So I know a lot of us are handicapped. And then there's these.
And what I could also do is take half of these and half of these. Ha ha, that's a good idea. And I have some other cards too. So I could split them up. Why don't I do that? And then Toby, I could send you half of a stack too. So let me do some mixing up of some cards and I'll send, um, cause Toby, you won something. So I'm sending you something anyway. So I'd be better just to send it in one pack all together. Oops. Okay. All right. So here we go. Hold on. All right, here I come, come back. Oops. Okay, so I figure, you know, you got to use... Okay, so hold on. Is that good? Well, I'm hoping I can get back to driving... But my foot is still, yeah, I understand, Toby. Okay, so the other thing, um, and we're going to be still praying about your foot too, my friend, is that, uh, so Dollar Tree has the lace ribbon. I don't know if you guys have still been able to find it. It's pretty hard to find still. Um, I also got... Because I'm going into my old Dollar Tree stash is what I'm doing. And I got this. And... Let's see what else. Oh, this. Okay. So I got a little ribbons there. And then, um, I don't know if you guys remember, but it's like, it's lace like this and it has the white lace on it, but you could take that off and that white lace. Oh, they still sell that ribbon, but in a different packaging. Okay. There you go. Um, So anyways, they have that lace sets on there too. And I, I don't have any right now, but I just saw it. I saw exactly what it looks like too. Okay. So, um, I got some ribbon here, sheer ribbon, lace ribbon, lace ribbon, and satin ribbon. So for bows, right? Hi. Hello, Nori Nori. Oh, and just so everybody knows, everybody's shipment's going out tomorrow. Tomorrow. I haven't been able to get them out because I have been so sick and tired. Just so tired. Welcome in, everyone. Okay, so you can color dye, right? Coffee dye, tea dye, do your thing, color it, paint it. Um... Do whatever you want to do, but use mostly Dollar Tree items. So, like, say they have, um, you know, like, pillowcases or, like, different cloths or stuff like that. You can use different cloth clothing or cloth items inside a Dollar Tree and then color dye them, right? Like in the um, home section. Three, four... It's about getting creative, right? So one, two, three, four, five. I'm going to take 10 pages out of mine. 
I'm going to work a little bit on my journal while we're on here so you guys can just get an idea of what I'm doing. And then I'm going to make the rest be a surprise because this will be one that someone wins is what I'm thinking. And I still, you know, I could put pages back. So I'm going to fold those down. And let me show you what my idea was. Okay. So there we go. Don't do that. Don't do that. Oh, sorry, guys. All right, hold on. So I got a new purse. It's so pretty. My daughter got it for me. Hold on. Let me see if I can get it untangled. Let me see. Look at my new purse. Isn't it cute? <laughs> Ella, you're so funny. Let's stay creative. She says that all the time. You're silly. I love it. It's never too late to create. Not meaning even if you're in bed, you can still create. Right? Okay. My tea. It's so hot that I'm not able to enjoy it. And I want to enjoy it now. I made um, peach tea. Hmm. With some honey. Yummy. Okay, so that's my cutesy little purse. Love it. Took my medicina. Okay, so let's do a little bit of work on this. Um, I might copy down my papers. I'm not sure. I am working with my inside. So let me show you what I'm thinking about doing. It's very bold. I think it is because it's not me at all. So I'm going to take inside the first page. It, this shows you where I'm going to cut my entire journal. So it's going to be cut off. Okay, so there's that. Very big bull move. And then I folded these over. And I'm going to fold this side over, right? So let me kind of show you. Fold that over. It's a little bit too much. So fold that over. And I'm going to go to the store this week. I'll buy a couple extra journals and um, like a couple of these journals and a couple extra cards. Okay, so I was thinking about then I'm going to, you know, make this a pocket. Yeah, a pocket, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, okay. And have it go like this. That's what I'm thinking. So I think I'm going to take my big page cutter. My big, big page cutter. And I'm just going to cut this. I think I'm going to do it right now. Ooh, it's right here. My big page cutter. I'm going to do it right now. Okay. Let's see. Let's work this. All right. All right, here we go, friends. This thing is so massive. I think you've seen it before. I gotta be careful getting it out. Okay. Jesus name. Okay, here we go. There we go. We made it. Okay. It's a big dog. Big, big, big dog. I'm going to have to turn it sideways. That's right. From the bottom to the top. Okay. She's on here. Get out the way, T. 
Okay, here she is. So, I'm going to go ahead and trim. Oh, this is really going to work out. Watch out, guys. It's going to... The table's about to move. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, that was a... That was that. So I can't go past... There. So let me mark that. Let me mark it. Okay. Can't go past that line. I better, better go ahead and mark it on the bottom, too. Hmm. Okay, it's like right under that scripture, so... Oh, I know. I'm, I am. I'm being careful. I promise. I won't lift what I can't. Okay, ready? Here we go. Here we go. Oh, there we go. It's cut. Oh my gosh. It's cute. Okay, hopefully. Oh, it's just the size of our card. No, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. <clears throat> All right. So let's see here. Because I was going to go like this. Okay. Let me think. Let me think. Let me think. Let me think. So I was thinking about having slots you know like our other journals and then these were this was just going to be like this um entry here right praying praying scripture book is what i was going to call it a praying scripture book so let me write that down praying scripture book. Hello, Debbie. Okay. And then I really, so my, this was my plan. Okay. Was I want to have a scripture submit to God and be at peace with him in this way. Prosperity will come to you. Right. Okay. Great scripture. Let's, let's flip it though. Let's go to Um, okay. He answered their prayers because they trusted him. So you know how prayers get answered? I thought I would put the answered prayers inside of here. That's what my thought was, but I was actually going to go from here was my idea. And I still might do that. Okay, do you see I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. How am I going to do that? Then I would have to do like a little hole. Okay, that would be cute. Yeah, let's do that. Hi, Penny. Oh, how fun. <laughs> I know, but it's going to be a list. So I'm going to just be able to pull the list is what I'm thinking out of the pocket. And I then can add to the list. Okay. So then say I go to the next one, right? So be merciful to those who doubt. So there, you know how there's people in your life that don't believe. So this would be my list of those, those people. That's what I was thinking. So I can pray the scripture over whoever is in those slots. That's my thinking. So that's what I'm going to go with. What are you guys going to do? Let 
What are you guys doing for the Dollar Tree Challenge? So I'm going to fold... Trying to fold it this the same as the last one, the one before it. Right? And this one, well, oh, this one is just a little wonky. Let me fold it down a little bit more. Oopsies. Okay, I think that's better. Let's see. I really want to have the scripture memorization plus, you know, who you're praying for. But this is what I'm giving away, too. But you know what? It doesn't matter. I can still do the same concept with my last one. This pretty much is that concept of, you remember when we I made the prayer junk journal? It's almost the same concept. We're just going to have scriptures on the front and then people inside of the pockets. And then what I'm going to do is I am going to, I still have some coffee in the other room. And I'm going to go ahead and coffee dye these pages. So that'll be nice. That's going to make it really ump up. And I'll go ahead and probably coffee dye like some of the lace and the ribbon make that look antiquey right okay let's fold this side and start folding that side <clears throat> okay so how is everybody? How is your week going? We got invoices done early. We got, um, which I'm just love it. Love that they're done early. Um, everything is already packaged up, ready to go. Just has to be taken to the post office. So loving that. Well, that it doesn't take forever, right? So, yeah. Very exciting. Okay, so all those are done. So, the fold will stay there even if it's if it's coffee dyed. So, that's going to give me how many pockets? It's going to give me one pocket, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then how many cards do I have? How many cards come in here? 20 cards come in here. <clears throat> okay. Well, the cool thing is, is I could also have one on the back. Yep. Cute. I'm going to do it just like that too so that this part is, sh is showing on the bottom. I want the cards at the top and then we're going to put that slot thing there. I think that's going to be cute. Cute. <laughs> I just was sitting here today and I was praying with the Holy Spirit. I was like, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? And that's what we're going to do. Yeah, and that's what we're going to do. And then I'll just... Oh, and then look at this. So when you antique them, that blue turns kind of a tealy color. Look at that. Which one looks better? Got a real sh big shadow coming here tonight. What is that? I'm sorry to all of that is you guys. Look at that. Hmm. 
No, where did you get the journal can be any type? Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree Journal. That's what I'm talking about. Dollar Tree Journal prayer cards. It's two things. Real easy. Real easy. Don't make it hard, people. I was just making a challenge. I thought it would be fun. And then I could just do, you know, um, as a giveaway. Because it would be a fun challenge to do. And it has to be a prayer journal. The point is, is you guys have to know, I am probably one of the only Christ-centered channels out there. And I'm not playing when I say I'm a Christ-centered channel. I'm going to build things that are going to be prayer-inspired. You know, I don't want to make an Alice in Wonderland journal. I'm sorry if that insults somebody, but I'm not into that stuff. I'm into God. I'm into Jesus so I would love for it to be a Dollar Tree prayer journal. That's what the challenge is. Yep. So Dollar Tree has, they had this one, prayer, Pray Without Ceasing. I know that they have like other ones. They had other colors, you know, just a Dollar Tree general, uh, Dollar Tree, one of their, um, one of their journals. They have tons of them there. All different kinds. So, um, this is one I got. Yeah, I think it's a super easy challenge. You know, people have to not complicate it, though. It's super easy. So, and then prayer cards, right? And you can use these any way you want. Cut them. Cut them out. Um, antique them. Do them back to back. You know, I had another idea that was really cute, that, but I just, you know, I mean, somebody else could do it. I thought it would be really cute, but to keep all the pages in here and then you have this fan out and then it's like this, you know, um, prayer card index, like, you know what I mean? No, it's perfect. Thank you, Ada. Thank you. So it does make it clear to everybody. Yep. So really simple prayer journal and, you know, yeah, everything I do is always going to be Christ centered. You guys always just be, be, let that be known to everybody because I don't want to go off course. I'm not going to do things like all of a sudden, Oh, let's do Harry Potter. That's not me. I, that's not me. I'm sorry. I am a Christ centered channel. I'm not going to stray away from God. I'm just not. The spring um, Happy Mail Exchange is up. That's Christ-centered too. So if we could send each other prayer cards and, you know, like we're supposed to sing hymns and things together, you know, to each other. So if we could send each other like Bible pages or um, say you went to a women's retreat and you got something, you could send that in the Happy Mail. It's kind of like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, Being really mindful of um, God's people and, you know, like each other and really loving each other, you know, through Happy Mail and sending each other stuff and right. So um, I, this is where I'm at. I'm going to um, coffee dye these guys. I'm going to pop them out. I'm going to show you what I'm going to do. I mean, kind of already just saw, but I'm going to pop these out. Okay. And, oh, this is what else I was going to say. I mean, if you guys want to use digitals and stuff, you can. I'm not. I'm going to keep it real, like just junk journaling. I'm going to go try to go as much Dollar Tree as possible. Um, I'm not going to pull out, like, my fancy laces or anything like that. I'm probably going to cover this. I was thinking with just like a really, I mean, cheap fabric, you know, really cheap, but by his stripes were healed, right? So this is what I was thinking about the cover. Oh, and I could do it like that and it could be a little shaggy. Let me do that. I could leave that right there, guys. Oh, I'm going to do that. Okay, let me cut that. I'm going to coffee dye those. Let's cut this real quick. I'm going to cut it 
kind of wide. Okay, cute, 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 cute. Yes, cute. Because I'm going to attach that right in there. By his stripes, we're healed, right? Do that shaggy, and then we'll do like, um, we'll do this one. Um, um, thank you, Ada. Sorry if I sounded snippy, you guys. I just recently, I just, I don't know, I've been approached with a couple of things, and I'm just like, nope. Nope, nope, nope. It's not me. I'm not doing it. You know, and I got to stay true to God. I, I I really know I have to stay obedient. Look at that. Will that be cute? So we'll do that. So how about we glue this down together? And then um, I wish I had my sewing machine in here because I would sew with you guys on here tonight okay hold on guys let me get this down i promise i'll be careful at it promise at it um oh gosh you guys guess what you have to look out for the video but i got my journal i got my journal in hold on i'm gonna show you guys a peek but you have to go watch the video but it's not up yet okay it'll be up um i don't know it's going to be up, though. I got my package from Hopeful Bird. Is it so cute? Is it so cute? I have not opened, not even... And, and can you believe I'm even holding on to it? Like, can you believe I'm even holding on to it? I haven't even opened this. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. Okay, so Hopeful Bird, here is the journal. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe it's here. Years, years I've waited. Years. So, we can't lose our, um, we can't lose our, uh, staples right there, guys. Can't lose them. Okay, here we go. Ready, ready, ready? Ready, ready, ready. This is just a fun little Dollar Tree, you know, challenge. I'm going to split up some cards while we're here on the, the live, too. I got, I got two other packs I was going to save for another project, but I'm going to go ahead and just split those up. I trust God. I know, I know there'll be more. I know. What great cards. I feel like... Dollar Tree has had these cards in the past or something. Have they, Etta? I wonder. So, being very careful <clears throat> around those staples. There we go. Do, 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 do. Uh oh. I just noticed something. My tea is so amazing now. It's really good. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, that's what I kind of thought. Sweet dreams. Bye, Brenda. Oh, okay. I was wondering. Because I feel like I had purple ones or something. Like Miss Bernie had given me. And I feel like she probably had gotten them from there. So, I was wondering. I was wondering. There's a card in here and it says something about sweet, getting sweet sleep in the prayer cards.
I sleep all night, y'all. I mean, all night. Sometimes I'll find myself praying in my sleep, though. Like, do you guys ever do that? I think we talked about that before. Hi, Marty. Nice to see you, friend. So this is where we're getting started on this. I probably should have painted my front, but it's okay. You know me. We're going to decorate up this front somehow. Oh, I have Dollar Tree flowers, so those count. Woo! Rock and roll. So I'm going to be putting some Dollar Tree flowers on the front of this journal. That'll be fun. It's not even a journal. What is this, guys? It's a... Uh... And I already have some bows, actually, um, from the Dollar Tree already colored. Let's see here. Do I? I was thinking I had some. Mm. All right. He dyed a whole, I coffee dyed a whole bunch of bows. I just kind of took them and I just splash them so it just antiques the very edges. It's funny. Look at that. Perfect that is. That's just like old fabric shredded up. Okay. I thought I had some Dollar Tree bows in here, but I guess I don't. I thought I did, but I don't. Yeah, yeah, great in your sleep, huh? Yeah. And I kind of want to coffee dye this, friends. This would go around, I'm thinking maybe the inside. I'll stitch it on the inside. That would be cute. Hmm. What about the outside? No, I think we're going to build, we're going to have to build something on here. Um, ooh, you know what would be interesting? So, remember at Dollar Tree, right? You got this stuff. Right? And then you got... Hold on. Let me see if I can reach it. You got... Okay. We got this stuff. This is from Dollar Tree. And... Oh, where did it go? I had a big pack of it. One second. Let me grab it. You get it at Dollar Tree, too. One sec. Where is it? You were just right here. Edda was just telling me about how I need to have all my stuff together. Because I don't have it all together. I was listening, Ed. I was listening. I still don't have my stuff together, though. Oh, here it is. Gosh, if it was a snake, it would have bit me, y'all. Seriously. Okay, so look at this for an idea. We could take a piece of this. And let's cut it. Let's cut it. We're going to just cut a piece. Because it's just, you know, a fun piece. What's really important is to remove right here this wire. Remove that wire, okay? Make sure you put it on your piece of paper so you can see it. Remove that wire, okay? And then what you want to do is take your wire and wrap it around your fingers like that, okay? Take your fingers out and then twist it into like the shape of an eight, okay? Now, you either can keep your wire for a project or you can throw it away. I'm throwing it away, but I just wanted to tell you that's a good way to, to manage, you know, that little wire. Because it hurts if it goes into your foot. Okay, so we're going to put down a piece of that. And then we got this stuff. I love this stuff. Jute cord. 
Eddie, do they still have the shoot cord? I always try and buy all my jute stuff there. Okay, let's see if we can get a, a starter here. There we go. I think we got one. We got a live one. Yep. Okay, sweet. So I thought we would take a little look at that mess. Nice. So we'll take some jute cord. And we might do something super creative with that. So, and then we got to take some string. Okay. You know, how we do our, our nest kind of thing. We're just making a, a nicer nest is all. And then we'll take a piece of our lace like that. Right. And then we're going to do it again. We're doing Father, Spirit, Son. Look at that. <laughs> How cute is this? Cute. That easy. So I've given you guys enough secrets tonight. What do you think? What do you think? I think it's a beautiful, nice little mess. Dollar Tree has nice fake flowers, right? No doubt. Oh, just love you, Etta. Can get some good finds. Good finds. Okay, so I'm figuring this is how my lace is going to shimmy on out. I'm just measuring it real quick to make sure I got enough or if I have to open a, a new pack. Now, does so does everyone need just the book and the cards, right? I mean, like, do, does anyone need... I don't know how much crochet lace I have. One, three. I know I have crochet lace for sale. But I don't have any more from the 99 cent store, I think. Let me look. Let me look. Let me see what I got. Do I have any? Mm. Yeah, I got a couple left. Okay, that works. So we're going to go around and around and around and around. Okay, cool. So I'm going to coffee dye all of this. Okay. I'm going to sew this. I'm going to do... I'm going to take this and I think I'm going to do a splash on this. And let me just see what I got here. Hold on. Okay, let's see. I'm going to make me a pretty bow if I can. I like making bows. I don't know if you guys knew that. I don't mind them. Even though they're fussy, I don't mind them. It's just like hair extensions. I had tremendous um, patience for hair extensions. When no one else had the patience, I did. Okay, there's our bow. I'm going to give it some legs. She's fabulous. There she is. We'll coffee dye that. Ooh. And then we want a couple of these. See, these are the ones that I thought I already had coffee dyed because I make a lot of these. Mm -hmm. I think everybody is too sweet. Everybody.
I know the sheer ribbon. I look for it every time I go there. I think this is the last of it. I use it so much and I really think this is like the end of it. This is all I have. I'm bummed about that. Dollar Tree. I'll try and have my husband take me tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yeah, because I'm not live tomorrow. I'll be live Friday. And, um, yeah. We got to finish up uh, Catherine's journal, y'all. Y'all want to help me? Inspire me? I'm going to do one more. One more bow. Yes. So, because I'd like to, um, yeah, and it's very shimmery, huh? Yes, it comes in colors. It came in like, what, peach and pink? Hold on, let me look. Because I think I still have some. Oh, let me see. Wouldn't that be pretty if I had some? Oh, I think I used it all at a... Oh, wait. It looks like this, huh? Sheer Creation. It's not this company, though. But it looks like this. I'm out of it. Yeah. Oh, well. At least I have this. Okay. There we go. We got a couple bows. Happy little bows. Cute. And what else could we do? Oh, 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 I didn't think about this. This is a good idea. So now, have you bought napkins, like, from the Dollar Tree? Because you could do that. That is a great idea. Um... Because I was thinking about doing some some of these these clips, and you do the um, what do you call it? You do the oh my gosh, get my words out. The napkin on these. Have you guys done that before? Where you cover this with the napkin? I got some napkins here, but recently I got these at the Dollar Tree. And what other ones came from the Dollar Tree? I think I recently saw this napkin. Wasn't this napkin recently? I am struggling to do watercolor postcards of purple. Come from. Try it in another color. Yeah, Marty. I thought you didn't like purple. Um, yeah, definitely trying a different color, but I think, I think I saw your watercolors. I thought they were beautiful. You're doing a great job. A great job, my friend. So I seen where someone has taken the napkin. Right. 
take the napkin and you take it apart, right? I know there's a faster way to do this. Here, let me do it. Let me get this tape. You get like a piece of tape, right, guys? There you go. So you peel that off, right? Okay. And then after that, okay, there's not another layer after that. There's just that, okay? Okay. Okay. So we're going to keep this little white piece because that's what you do. That's what you do as a junk journal. But you're supposed to take, like, okay, these little flowers and, and that, okay? And I guess that's kind of what you do. So we're going to take the Mod Podge out. Mod Podge, that's outdoor. We don't want that one. We want... Oh, here we are. Mod Podge. Gloss. Luster. Fine. Please, Luster. We have no problem with that. So we need a brush. We'll go with a fan fan brush. Oh, I don't know. Comb flowers are purple. I don't know. I can't Google to tell you. So I'm going to cut this little piece out. Right? Okay, I'm going to just cut it out. Okay, boom. And I'm going to paint. And do it just like that. Here we go. We're going to paint right here. This little side. You got to paint the whole little wood on the side, okay? And then you go ahead and stick that down. Okay, right there on the top, and then go ahead and I guess you do. <laughs> I don't know. You do this part. I think we. I think we have to end up cutting it. Let's just go with the flow. Go with the flow. Go with the flow. Stay with it. Okay. Now go and paint on the sides. Yeah, I thought your watercolor work was beautiful. Keep at it. I'm telling you, it's going to get better and better. Keep at it. So fun. Such a gift to be able to even do that. Okay, so you see that, guys? So I did that. So now we're just going to go on this side lightly. Lightly. And if you guys end up doing this project, hey, shout out, show me. Say, hey, Junk Journal and Jen showed me this project. Or, you saw it over here, come join us. We need more friends to join us, friends. Okay. So I'm going to kind of just pull, I'm kind of pulling it away now. So I'm just slowly just working that paper away. I'm just pulling it, pulling it down. I know it's going to get a little bit messed up here and there, but it's cute. Look at that. I just paint that down. I think what I'm going to let it do is dry just a little. That looks really good. But I'm going to let this one dry. Okay. So let's see what happens when we let it dry a little. But I'm really loving how it's looking. There it goes. There it goes. There it goes. 
There we go. Cute. Cute, cute, cute. I hope you guys can see that. Nice. How cute this turned out. Look at that. And now that is an, a Dollar Tree thing haha, that I just made. Cute. Okay, so there's number one. Going to put that up there. I'm going to let... There you go. Sketch something and gently water it. Smart. Smart idea. All right, let's try another color. Let's try, um, well, <clears throat> let's do an all green one first. I think that would be cute. Let's do an all green one. And then also let's do, I know we did that one, but let's do this more peach. Let's get this peach one on there. So we'll do that one. We'll do the peach one. And then we're going to do from this one. <clears throat> You guys are talking about watercolor. I have a friend that does it. You know, Marnie, you could do watercolors and turn them into your own digitals. Sell them on Etsy. Or are you just doing it for pure fun? Oh, you didn't miss anything, my friend. You didn't. You really didn't. We're here. Although I think this project is really fun right now. I'm going to get really, really liking this, guys. I've been wanting to do these for so long. It's crazy how long we'll put off projects. You know, it's like we think about them, think about them, and then we just never do them. Just put off, put off, put off, put off, put off, put off. Right? Really bad about that, aren't we? At least I am. Today, I found so many undone projects that I need to work on. Well, I don't need to do anything, but I would love to work on them. But I slept. I did. I hung out with my daughter. We hung out. We've been talking business, talking shop. We got 500 pages of paper coffee and tea dyed. We are officially opening the Etsy store. I think I told you guys that. So you can pick up items that like I'm working, like say I'm, I'm working on something and you need, you want to have that same item. I'll have it available in my store. Isn't that going to be cool? And even when, say, we're in a sale and I've added stuff to the store, you could go to the Etsy store and say, hey, can you add that, that, that? And I can do that. Okay, so there's that one. Oh, hold on a second. I missed so much of the slide. Okay, I got that. Hi, Kimberly. Glad you're home safe. I missed a whole bunch too, Kimberly. My hubby. Slight pain emergency. What? Oh, I hope he's okay, Stacy. Him too. 
Thank you. Where did you show your wall with Carl Marty? Okay, so she was just explaining about the challenge. Must use notebook, journal, and prayer cards. Mm. I get what Ed is saying. That I was mostly just talking about the Dollar Tree cha um, challenge. Which is just... Um, Kim, I cut this book, my friend. Oh my gosh. Oh, I already covered the cover. I'm so sorry. You'll have to rewatch it. But I already covered the cover. Um, and it was just some, you know, like, uh, what was it called? Is a pillowcase. Like, you know, a pillowcase. And then I just cut and ripped it around, coffee dyed it. I already had that ready. And then I just have all the Dollar Tree stuff out. Remember, this has like the lace that goes in the center. So I might use that lace that goes in the center on this project. Then I got some different ribbons out. Um, and this one that are from the Dollar Tree that I'm going to use on this project. And then I'm going to coffee dye my paper so they're over here. And then I made a front with like using all the... Um, jute twines the twines from dollar tree and yeah yeah so that's what we've been doing so far we've gotten a little bit done so then i was all of a sudden got this idea to um do a couple of these because i've never done them before and my friend Monica is the one that send, sent me the very first ones I ever got. Ticking. Oh, I think it's awesome that I have energy too, Kim. Thanks, friend. I'm blessed. I really, you guys, I, I want to live. And so I'm living, you know. And I think, you know, we take it for granted every day. And so I'm living to the full and you guys, I really am excited about some of the projects that are going to be coming out. Um, I didn't get to show my daughter today, but oh, what is that? Gross. This stuff gets hard fast. I need to pour it in a separate cup. Let me do that. So I'm not over here like wasting I gotta figure that out because it's it's over here getting um clumpy on me guys. Um anyway, some projects and so I'm gonna have a kit coming out um this next month. It's absolutely beautiful. It's mm, kinda similar to the kit that you guys just saw that Stacy and um Kim had gotten. Who else got the other kit? Does anyone recall at the moment? Um, oh, I know Etta got one of the kits, design team. Oh, and then my sister-in-law, Vanessa, in Nevada, she got one. And, okay, I was just thinking about that. Um, anyways, this kit is way out, though. It, it's not that the other ones weren't, but this one, of course, you know, you're going to get better and better at what you do so um i don't know have you guys heard of like there are kit clubs like i know some people are of uh, uh, um what do you call it a part of them like have you guys ever heard of house of books well she has a club and you can buy old books from her. And she ships you these old books, I guess, every month. And it's so many. And, you know, that you agree to buying or whatever. You know, so it's like a subscription. Look at that one. That turned out cute. <clears throat> okay, let's do another one. I'm, I'm, I think I'm addicted to these right now. And I'm okay with it. <clears throat> Have you ever heard of them? T 
kicking. Yeah. That's exactly what it is. I think that's what it is. Um, I do have some ticking, but it's much nicer than this. This is not that nice. This is just a pillowcase. Like, you know. Because it already had the seam. But I do have some ticking. And I forgot about it. I need to pull it out. I could actually sell some if someone was interested. Totally forgot I had it. <laughs> Did they make pillowcases out of ticking, guys? I wonder. They could, huh? So, you know me, I'm always thinking by his stripes, we are healed. So that's why I'm going for the stripes. Do, 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 do. So, how fun is that? gonna be too fun man I wish some of y'all just lived closer so we could just craft together I know Stacy lives close but she she has kids and a hubby she's a busy lady Okay, so there's that one. What does it say? They sell nice things. What, from the book girl that I told you about? House of Books? <clears throat> Ooh. Thanks, Stacy. Oh, yeah, we could do that. Stacy, we could work out a night that you could come and craft. Ooh, we should do that. Ooh, this is terrible. Hold on, you guys. Let me get this um, glue glob. We're going to use this tissue that we're supposed to supposedly save. Ooh. -ee. Wow, Mod Podge really does that sometimes, huh? I still love it. <laughs> I love Mod Podge. It's just consistent. Consistently shiny. <laughs> okay, I'm going to close it for a minute. Just real quick. So I'm going to cut some napkins. Um, I really wanted the blue... Ooh, perfect. Look at that. Let's do it. Yeah, glue goober. Exactly, friend. Gross. Okay, here we go. Do we have another one? Oh, we do. Look. Three on this. Three total. But this last one, I got to be careful. I can tell it's delicate. So I'm just going to slowly. So we're making clothespin. What are we making? Clothespin. Decoupage clothespins. Right? Isn't that what we're doing tonight? I know we've done a couple of things, but... Ooh, take it from this angle.
Okay. Check this out. Come on, little brush. Okay, let's get us some friends. Oh, I love it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of place it where I want it, flip it over, right? And then I can kind of cut around it a little. Kind of. It's not easy. Okay. And then the back, like that. Okay. Oh, thank you, Toby. I have this is my first project with a napkin in whew, a long time. I feel like definitely wanted the blue with this. Okay, and I'm gonna do one more snip, and then I'll give us three. These are a lot easier than I thought they were going to be. I, I'll be honest, I've been overthinking them for uh, quite a long time. Jen, do you do both sides? Um, I was thinking about that. What do you think? I think we should. Maybe it'll be a little bit more plain. I, I've never done these before. It's my first time ever. So I was thinking maybe we should do um, both sides. Is anybody else making these right now? I mean, like, gosh, what an easy project to pull out and do real quick. Let's see here. You guys, can you see now? Okay, can you guys hear me? I think that'd be pretty clipped onto a journal too. Sorry guys. My mama, she had called, but it's okay. These blue ones are awesome. I'm going to let them dry, and then I'll kind of start to tear some sections off or cut. 
you know, some areas off. So let the, I'm going to let that dry. You guys are going to be surprised. These dried up here, and they're a completely different color. Okay, good. You guys can hear me. Yay. You guys are so good. I missed y'all. I'm so used to going. Well, you know, Ronnie was working, like, a lot. Um, and so that's why I was going live so much. And now he's not working so much, so. Which I'm fine with. I love my husband. I miss him. I just love hanging out with him. He's my best friend. He is. So Ronnie and I are both going to be 50 years old this year. Ronnie is going to be 50 in um, April. And I am going to be 50 in June. This is our 50 year. So I think it's going to be a great year. It already has been great. Really has. I feel like it has been very great. I've met all of you in a deeper way this year. And I'm getting closer and closer to knowing you all, which I really love. I think that is so fun, and I'm just blessed. Okay, we're going to let that one dry. <clears throat> Chris is 50 this year, too. Very cool. Yeah. It's a big old, big fat old. Okay. Get that on there. We'll put a little tiny bit on the sides. I hope you guys can see okay. Okay. <clears throat> okay, here we go. Push that down on the side. I feel like it always ends up being one, a little bit more on one side than the other. So funny. Okay. I found some, so, man, I found some just super cute journals today. They're little, but they are so cute. They're more of your um, TM size. Sorry, TN, Traveler, notebook size. Um, and they were inspired by our beautiful friend, Tanya. I just adore her. Tanya Samuels. I love that... Um, I got to know her on TikTok, and now she knows me on you know, on Instagram, and that so it's pretty cool that I've gotten to know her a little bit. Well, you know that we say hi in that, so it's pretty cool. I adore her. Okay, um, let's see what else do we have. Um. No, I don't want any more of that color. And we did all those. 
so are you guys still here with me or are we getting tired yet we're reaching our our normal stopping time which i hate to jump off but i also know people get tired I don't know what other napkins came from. Those won't show up. That won't show up. This won't show up. That won't. That won't. That won't. This would show up. Ooh, and these would be cute. Just gorgeous. When they I'm sorry guys, I'm just going through some napkins. There's like a city. Those won't show up. We got some checkers. Happy birthday, Renee. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Renee. Happy birthday to you. And many more. Those are pretty, y'all. I don't think they'll show up. But man, that's a pretty napkin, huh? I love that. <laughs> Happy birthday. Okay, that's a lot of napkins. All right, we'll put those two away. I'm going to bag of napkins. This is the best way for me to store them because I notice that I don't use them if I don't see them. And so I put them on my shelf in these bags. And now I'm more aware of them. And so I used them today. So proud. So proud. Okay, I'll put that napkin back. And I'm going to just real quick. What time is it? 8.12. I still got time. I still have time. Mm. Yeah, I think I'm only going to do one of these. Because it's kind of the rough part of the napkin. So I want to keep the smooth, the smoothness going. Okay. So I got that. Ooh, that one's nice. I'm going to do a couple more and then we'll jump off. I don't know if that's going to show up right there. Let's see. one is hmm. wow this one's being super sensitive 
friends. I've never had a napkin be this sensitive. Wow. Okay. Excuse us. Well, we'll take the little ripped sections. We have no problem with that at all. We will use them. We sure will. Yep, just like that. We will use it. We will use it. Oh, my brush is starting to get stiff on me. It's like, no, mm -mm, you're leaving me out the water way too long, lady. So I'll have to get it some water. Okay. Pretty. Here we go. Hopefully this will show. I gotta, ooh. I gotta cut it just a smidge. It's, I can see it has a weird fold. Okay, there's that. And let me go around. I gotta cut this side too. And then this has to be cut there. I'm literally cutting it just like you do a little book. Like I'm getting neater now. Now, now that I'm learning. Okay. Hopefully this shows. Let's see. Um, there we go. Okay, sorry to be so quiet. I'm trying to get that to uh, hold down and I keep popping up the other side. There we go. Okay. There we go. Well, we'll have to just see about this one. I don't know, friends. Don't know. It's pretty light. <clears throat> okay, we'll do this one. Okay, let's do it. So what I noticed is it's like, put it on, right? Try and get it as center. It's so hard to, because you can't see. Get it on there, right? And really get it on, on there without trying to get it to the sides yet, right? Okay, so got it on there in the center. Flip it over real quick. And then trim it. Right? I'm noticing this is the best. And then even square off on your square on your corners. Okay. Square off on those. Because it's helping fold. Okay. And then make sure that you don't have too much extra paper on the, the side. Okay. So just trim, trim, trim as much as you can. Because you don't want it overlapping too much. Like the other ones I did, they're, they're kind of messy, but it's okay. I learned. So now see, I'm lined, I'm totally lined up on the sides. The front will fold over easy. Er, okay. Um, folding the back over right there. Fold this back down. Okay. And then I get a little bit and then right here. Go ahead and fold that down now.
Got a little bit messy right there, but it's okay. Like that, and then fold that over. Fold that over. Okay. There's that one. Whoopsie. Look at the blue ones. Ooh, those turned out. Look at how pretty these are. It'll show more when it dries. Yeah, look at the blue. So far. Those turn out great. So we got the blue ones. See, that's where I needed it to. That's so. Take these really sharp scissors and I'll take it and I'll cut it. There you go. Okay. Now here goes the other ones. Look how good these turned out. Those turned out great. Look how bright they are. Mm -hmm. Love them. Gosh, those turn out so pretty. I really love those, you guys. I love those. All right. Well, gosh, it's 822. What you gonna do? Do a pink one. That's what we do. We'll do a pink one. We need a pink one in our lives. Where would we be without a pink one? Let's do it. Okay. This one's a pretty bright pink one. Pretty bright. This one is uh, Prima Marketing. Oopsie. Accidentally set that down on the wrong side. Okay, push this down. Good night, Marty. Sweet dreams, friend. I hope you get peaceful, nice rest. I pray you all get good rest tonight. I know for us on the West Coast, it's still early. It's like still crapped in time. <laughs> I go to bed. What time do you guys usually go to bed? I'm just curious. What's everyone's sh shut down time? Mine is 1030. I, I like 1030. And, or earlier. I, I like earlier too. I mean, honestly, I could do 830. <laughs> I can. That one's going to turn out really nice once it dries.
this is just a random one I have hanging out right here on my desk. So I just thought I'd grab this tissue. I cut a little bit on this edge. Boom, ba -da -da -dum, boom. Lots of love to ya. Okay. Around 11, 12, yeah. That's a long day at a... We get up about... Well, it depends. But I feel like we're always waking up like 4.30, 5. Ronnie has to be up 5. And then he makes sure that I'm up no matter what at 6. And I take my meds. That's how I start the day. Boom, 6 a.m. Every day. Every day. That was it. That was our last one for tonight. Yep, that's the last one for tonight, friends. Yay. I think that turned out great. I got it empty. Oh, I do. I'm going to use this. Yeah, 7 a.m. for meds. Yep, first thing, huh? Yay. All right. Well, I use some of the water for that. Don't want my brush to get bad on me because we need our brush. But thanks so much for making these clips with me. We're getting our journal started. So get your Dollar Tree journals. Your Dollar Tree general. No, your Dollar Tree. Ugh, see, it's late now. Journal together. Start working on it. You can post pictures if you want of your progress. You're more than welcome to do that. And, um, yeah, that's what we got cooking. So I'm super excited. Thank you all so much for joining me tonight. I'm going to clean up. And uh, I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to work on a journal a little bit tonight or not. But you guys have a blessed night. Thank you so much for joining me. Oh, Maritza, sorry we're missing you. We're just getting ready to log off. We made... Um, Decoupage. Uh, what are these called, guys? Clothes blind clips, right? I made these. I made these. These are still drying. These blue ones are beautiful. But, yep, that's what we made tonight, so... Thanks so much for joining me, friends. Thanks for joining me. I appreciate you guys so much. I love you. Good night. Bye. Make sure you sign up for the Happy Mail. If you're interested, we would love for you to join our Happy Mail Exchange. It's inside the Junk Journal and Gen Group, so go and check it out there. And if you haven't signed up for Junk Journal and Gen Group yet, go ahead and do that. We would love to have you over there. You're more than welcome to post pictures and all of those great things. All right, my friends, I will talk to you soon. Be blessed. Bye-bye. Decoupage closed pins. Amen. Bye.